What is going on everyone, Bitter Hyena here. Now today's video, like always, I am a little late getting up. Same excuses as normal work, just been working a ton. I've had a lot of people out, they've cut our hours, blah, blah, blah. You guys don't care about that. But anyways, today, without further ado, we will be opening up the newest Japanese set, Fusion Arts. Now I keep getting this set's name and the English set's name like mixed up. This one is Fusion Arts, the English set is Fusion Strike, I believe. But I seriously don't know how many times before making this video I had to go online and check to make sure I was calling it the right thing so it didn't look like a complete fool in this video. But either way, I'm excited to open it up. I picked it up from CardboardCollectible.com. If you would like to get some cards from them or any other kind of card, whether it be English or foreign, I will leave a link in the description below to their website. 100% recommend them. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get this new set open. Now, like I say, with most of these new Japanese sets, this one has some amazing alter art cards in it. There are some that are fairly cheap, which is, I believe, a Greedent V, which looks awesome. Honestly, it's it's one of my favorite like alt arts that we've gotten so far. There is a Breakdancing Genesect. There is a Mew V and a Mew V Max alter art. They look great. There are so many Mew cards in the set, though. We get Mew V, Mew Alter Art V, Mew V Max, Mew Alter Art V Max, the full art, and the Hyper Rare. So, I would love to get one of the Mews, whether it be the full art or anything like that. I will be happy, or you know, the Greedent full art. But either way, let's get into this box. I am excited, though. I will say. Uh, I am getting less and less excited about celebrations the closer it gets because I have seen a lot and it's all it is is just the people trying to jump on the hype of Pokemon like normal I mean they're opening up the sets half of them aren't even opening the like normal packs they're just ripping into the celebrations and if they don't get anything that is a base set to Venusaur Charizard or Blastoise it's basically just thrown to the side I am excited to get it open myself, but some of these videos are just, I don't know, disheartening? Is that the right word? But anyways, enough of that. We will get to that set later this week. Let's get into this here. We have got our normal set of packs, you know that. The art is honestly awesome. I love that giant Mew above the city there. It's so cool. There is the side artwork, the front, and the other side. It's a lot of good looking hollows in the set. I have slowly started to like begin posting card releases again, or not releases, like announcements, whether depending on what cards we get in sets, you know, that thing, kind of thing, whatever. Uh, but I don't really follow a, a lot of the other cards that are released in the set, whether it be the hollows, the uncommons, commons, like that. So there's a lot of those that are going to be kind of surprising. So I guess that's still good. But all right, let's get to it. There we go, beautiful pack art. Kind of dark though with it being the hollow. All right, well, with it being hollow I should say. Let's get into this. It has been a while since I've recorded. I am excited to see what this set has in store for us. We've got an Arcanine starting out. We got a Bunnelby. We got the Galarian Zigzagoon, looks cute. Ooh, that is a crazy looking Durant there. I really haven't seen that one. And then we got this chick here, which she is a full art in the set. Don't recall your name, but I do know you are a full art. There is a, I think like the male version of her in here as well. All right, next pack. We have got uh, Galarian Crusola, a cute little skitty. We got the awesome Caterpie artwork, great. We got a heap more in our first V is Genesect. That is a cool looking card. What's he got? Yeah, he's got that like cityscape in the background. That is nice. Very cool. I will take that one. The main V I want, of course, is Mew. I am hoping we do pull it. The Greedent one actually looks pretty cool. I don't normally like that big old fat squirrel, but the card art is very nice. We've got a Comia frog and all there very cool we got the thing there we got a geodude awesome artwork cute little metapod and some walkie talkies okay all right 
Why not? Let's see here. Pack number four. Yeah. Four. Let's see what you can get here. All right. We have got the big old trash bag. Uh, Clam Pearl. Awesome Onyx artwork. That is so cool. Oh, I love that card. That looks so nice. We got a Rookie D staring at a shadow. And our first hollow is Toxtricity. And it is the blue one. Yeah, there's a blue one and a yellow one. But that, the background on that looks awesome. It almost looks like DNA strands. I'm guessing it's more like sound waves or something like that. That is cool. I like it. Good looking hollow. There's also a Steelix hollow in this set that I am super excited for. That is the one. If we pull double of hollows, that is what I want. We've got the little Pokemon Candies, which is a gold card. We got Shroomish, the Charger Bug card, Yukimori, uh, Snom, yeah. She posted a quick little set of photos on how she made that Snom card on, I think, Twitter and Instagram both. It's pretty cool to see the background of it. I liked it. Very cool Yukimori card. Probably one of my newer favorites. All right. We have got Frost Moth there barely tell what you were we got a snubble fullaby we have got the little dude in the armor and our next hollow is the steelix i mean look at that that is so cool oh i have the last few sets that we have gotten steelix cards in they have looked amazing and this one is no different all right Next pack, we've got some kind of golden badge there. Never seen you. We've got Togenomaru, the little baby trash bag, a Muna, and we've got the middle ghosty dragon. I don't remember your name. I'm just now getting to the point where I remember Dreepy and Dragapult. All right. We have got um, the Selgor, I think is you. We've got a cute little Growlithe. A Breloom, I believe we got Dreepy there. See, know that one. And our next V is Greedent. See, now like I said, I don't normally like Greedent, but this card looks so cool. Such a massive freaking squirrel just stealing all the berries and his tail too there. Dang. Cool V. Very nice artwork. All right. We are, I would say, about halfway done with the right side now. Still no secret rare yet, though I have seen two hit boxes, so that is also a chance. I believe British Gaming got one, so maybe we can get one, be nice. We got a Totodile and um, one of the dancing birds, uh, Orcorio, yeah. I knew I'd remember the name. I'm actually having some pretty good luck remembering these names this time around. Yes. Go me, go me. All right, we've got some big old golden bell, a bunnelby, we got a musharna, a galarian zigzagoon, and a hollow fralligator. Didn't know you were a hollow there, boy. You look good, not too bad. All right, let me resituate that again. All right, we are down to like four, four packs on this, this half, something like that. All right, we've got which looks to be some kind of switch. It's I think it's a new card though. We got a Melmetal, oh no, Meltan. Yeah, we got Gloomy, Groomy, whatever, Glarian, uh, Corsola. Yeah, and a Verizian. There we go. Non-hollow. Kind of weird to see you as a non-hollow, since you are a legendary. It is really weird to me to see legendary cards just as like normal rares or uncommons or stuff like that. Oh, there we go. One of my favorite mythic Pokemon. We got Meloetta. Awesome. We got the Nasty Bunny. We got that thing. We got Helio. Helio list. Helioptile. One of them too there. Ooh! Oh, I about had a freaking heart attack. There is our secret for the box and it is all our Genesect. Oh, yes. That is such a nice card. See, there we go. Genesect Breakdancing. That is so cool. Oh, I am so happy with that. I love pulling these alt art cards. And it is 
seems very well centered there and so on the back it's kind of hard to tell on the back of Japanese cards since it's not like an actual line it's kind of like fuzzy but either way there we go Genesect Alter Art card that is so cool oh, what a beautiful hit man yes good good box thank you cardboard collectibles happy with this it is no alt art Mew but it's an alt art and I will take it there we go sleeve you up I do finally have my perfect fit sleeves close to me oh nice I am so happy with that Genesect heavy box boys all right there we go we have got what three more packs left for the right side now I say this and I hope I don't jinx myself but since we did pull the secret rare in the first half it always means we can pull a second one it always means we can pull a second one it always means we can pull a second one let's see here we've got um what is her name Elisa, I think something like that anyway she's a full art normal full art a hyper rare as well y'all know and then we got such a cute phalanx card on the end too that is cool a lot of ni nice arts in this set very very good set all right next up what are we gonna get here let's see we've got another crog all there cute card now this one I love this card it is whatever the other Heliolisk, Helioptile, whatever your freaking name is. But it's almost got like that comic book coloring, the like dots there in the background. Such a cool card. Very, very unexpected, I guess you could say. We got a Puke and Muki and a Hollow uh, Latios. Very cool fusion symbol there at the top. Now there is a Deoxys that is very weird. It's got the single stripe rapid strike and fusion strike uh little logo in there it's too many logos man i love my logos but ugh, a bit much all right we got the little trash bag again charge bug and these boys from oh, what is it x and x and y i think black and white i can't remember man but either way there we go this is a cool card they are also a full art would not mind pulling it might have to pick it up eventually either anyways all right enough chat in there push that off to the side on to the left half see what other V's and V maxes we can get I actually haven't pulled a V max yet so hopefully it is the Mew one there we have got what is your freaking name if you'll focus maybe there we go uh yeah I don't remember Shroomish, the cute little snom, another heat war. And speak of the devil, there is our first VMAX, and it's Mew. Oh, such a cool card. VMAXs really don't, there's nothing really too special about them. The backgrounds are all the same, more or less, but you get to see Mew on a card that's textured. It's always good. It's so cool. There we go. First VMAX of the box. Mew, happy with you. Now, if we can just get your V, yeah. All right. Next pack. There's a lot of pink in this set, man. Obviously, with it being Mew, but still. All right. We've got a Golem exploding. First time pulling you. We've got a Geo dude, the little Bone Bird, a Jinx, and a Corviknight. All right. Let's see. I don't remember what the other VMAXs are or the other Vs, to be completely honest. I think there's one more we haven't seen besides the Mew. Um, maybe we'll see it. Who knows? You got a Hollow Butterfree there. Cute card. Not much to it, but it is cute. All right. Moving on. How about another pack of Fusion Arts? Why not? Let's see here. We have got the Big Bug, Beagle Bolt, remembered your name at the very end. We got a Snubble, a Caterpie, and a, yeah, it's a so so artwork. You can always tell so so artworks. They're very, very different, very cool. I like it. Glaring Laloon. 
All right. Let's see next pack. All right, we have got this energy again. I can never remember what you're called. We got another rookie D, a Musharna, a Clan Pearl, and there is the Awful Father, Dragapult. Cool looking card, especially with those like lines coming off the Dreepies. It's cool. Not bad. You can see the city in the background as well. I'll take it. All right. Let's see here. What else can this awesome box give us? I am still, still so happy about that uh, Genesect. But they did Latios a little wrong here. Uh, Latios. Latios got the hollow. Latios is just the normal uncommon. Very odd choice to do, but whatever. We got a Galarian Zigzagoon, a Muna, and a that dude who is a very forgettable Pokemon. I hate to say it, but yes. Dunsparce, there's not much to ya. I don't even know. I don't think you're even, like, fairly good playable, like, in the video games. I don't know. Gumi, we got this little dude here. And our next V is Mew. Yes. Oh, that is such a nice card. I am so happy we got Mew. There we freaking go. Oh, yes. All right. Now, if we can just get another secret rare, this box would be top tier. Top tier box here. All right. Next pack here. We've got a, another Galarian Cursola. That thing. We've got Dreepy. A cute little star U. And a Frost Moth. Which, like I said, that Frost Moth. All the blues and whites, it is so hard to tell where Frost Moth is actually at. Alright. Speed this up a little bit here because it is hot as shit in this room I am recording in. Oh, we got a Bunnelby. A Toxel there. Yeah. And there we go. There is the V I couldn't remember. Uh, Serena to Serena, whatever you want to freaking call her. But there we go. Very cool card. I'm happy with that one. I think... Hmm, no. I think we are missing one more V. I don't remember what it is, but I do believe we are missing one. All right. Next up here. Let's see. I don't remember what the other V maxes are, like I said. We've got the middle ghost dragon there, a drillbur, a corsola. Yeah, we got the little baby drill. Yeah, no, that one's drillbur. The big one's excadrill. And we've got huntail, which is one card. I can't remember the last time I seen a huntail card, to be completely honest. All right, next pack. One to the front. I think we'll be able. I think we'll be pretty good here on this video. I don't know. We've got this boy here. First time seeing you. We got, yep, we've got you. It always means we can pull a second one. We've got you. Double hit box. Yes. Gold. Oh, gold leaf energy. Mm. Alt art and a gold card. Oh, God, yes. That made me lightheaded. Oh, my God. Oh, I am so happy with that two hit box, man. My God, what freaking hits. Oh, all right. I'm going to have to let the camera sit for a second because I don't want to, uh, I don't want to lose this footage, man. All right, guys, I am back. It has literally been like 45 minutes since I stopped recording this. Uh, yeah, this was crazy. I cannot believe we actually got a two-hit box, but literally five minutes after I stopped recording this, I got a call from my girlfriend who went out to Burlington because I heard some people were finding some celebrations at Burlington, and guess what? She managed to find the Selvion, Dark Selvion, and Lance Charizard V-Box for their celebrations. Yes, so tomorrow we will have an extra video for this week. Of opening some celebrations early so yeah look forward to that but anyways let's finish up this epic box of fusion arts we have got four packs left 
what can we finish this box off with we are still getting another v max somewhere in here all right we have got uh the big freaking dragon i can't remember its name we got a graveler first time pulling that looks awesome skitty a token amaru and another corvanite all right next one here let's see what we can get now hopefully i can find some more celebrations for friday's video as well but either way we will have up some at least this week we got uh what is rookie d's second form i can't remember but there we go and oh there's the other v all right it's bold hound now i remember there we got bold hound b max yeah bold hound b max very cool not bad I like the spiky look of his tail you can actually kind of see it a lot better this time around not bad but there's our final v max let's see what we can get out of the last two packs possibly a hollow either way i am just floored with what we have gotten in this box oh cardboard collectibles sending us some fire like always love it and we got the big old trash bag all right final pack of the new japanese set fusion arts let's see what we can end with here i might possibly pick up another box of this somewhere down the line here all right we have got a cute little phalanx again we got geo dude the little trash bag we got a breloom i think yes and we got another hollow it's mel metal there we go not bad let's take a quick look at our v hits here we got genesect greedent and of course oh no wait oh, i forgot about this mu v and the serena to serena whatever you want to call her i really don't know how to say her name but there we go i am happy with all of those these three here my main ones don't really care too much for bolt hound so i'm not upset that we didn't pull them but there we go happy with those four we did get our two v max hits our mew and bolt hound both very cool looking cards i love the mew though very very happy with that one shame we didn't pull any other mews other than that but i cannot say this box was bad because we got an alt art genesect v and the gold grass energy two hit box folks it has been a little bit i think we got one a couple months ago with i think it was what was it um ice lance i think we got a two hit box there both full art trainers but yes here we go this i am happy with this gold card and an alter art pokemon does not get any better than that but alrighty guys if you enjoyed this video hit that like button if you're new subscribe and check out another video while you're at it don't forget to hit the little bell button get notifications of more videos go up and like i said if you would like to pick up this box here or any other pokemon box or any other english or japanese sets i will leave a link in the description below to cardboard collectibles go check them out 100 recommend them and stay tuned to the channel for tomorrow's celebration opening fingers crossed we can pull one of the base set cards and or even the i think the what is it the gold star umbreon is also in the set so that would even be amazing oh cannot wait to crack into this set but either way we are going to get some awesome pulls so if you are not subscribed hit that subscribe button it'll be greatly appreciated and you can get notified when the video goes up but as always guys thank you so much for the love and support it is greatly appreciated and i will talk to you all later see ya